Hello there guys and girls, this is Pixel and once again we are back with another Rocket League crate opening video because I am very much addicted as you can tell and since the last video I don't think I had my looper wheels which I've now got which are absolutely awesome but I found a community on PS4 with like thousands of people in, there's at least like 20 people online at one time in the community and um, I basically said that I had some things to trade and one of them I put Dark Matter up because I have a duplicate because I got that in the last crate opening episode and someone traded me 12 champion one crates for it so we, we don't have any champions three crates for this video but we're going to open i think 14 champions crate one see what we can get and then trade up and um but something else that did happen you remember in my last crate opening video i said i just need one more very rare um champions crate three uh to get five so i could trade it for an import champions three well i got a fifth one in a crate that i got last night for playing and I got the breakout type S again. Now, a few of you did say in the comments, oh, there's an invitation from Adam. I'll, I'll talk to I'll talk to him later on after I've done this video. Um, but because uh, <laughs> he probably wants something of mine. Um, and uh, basically, a few of you in the comments did leave some really good offers. But someone else offered me a lot higher, like 15 crates. So I had to take that. But someone else has offered me for this one, 10 champions, 3 crates. So... Uh, I should be doing a crate opening video on that in a few days, but now we're gonna get in and open these champion crate ones uh, To be honest, I'm not really looking for anything other than maybe some very rare things to trade up to an import or just some wheels To be honest just the universal decal like I'd really like heat wave that would make my day So let's get in and do this crate opening big Thank you to the guy who gave me the 12 crates for the dark matter a duplicate item So, you know, I just have to get the keys to open the crates and first up, we have a Takumi Anubis. I'll take that. It's very rare. You know, we can trade those in. I'll, I'll be happy with that. If we get a load of very rares, then, you know, that that is fine. Let's go back in. I've never done a crate opening this big, I don't think. 14 crates is pretty big. I think I think even off camera, I don't think I've opened this many in one go. So, it makes me feel like a proper YouTuber. All right, what are we going to get now? The Vice. Uh, not that great, but we'll take it. Well, I'll take pretty much anything in terms of these crates because you can just trade them all in. But because it's f nearly 15 crates, that's over 10 pounds worth of keys. So it would be really nice to get something lovely, okay? Because 10 pounds is a couple hours working at McDonald's. So <laughs> that's what I'm putting down the drain here. <laughs> so I don't need a Dominus Arcana, all right? So there we go. That's that's my plan. Just going to keep opening these crates. We're going quick fire to get these crates done and see what we can get. And then I can go talk to Adam and see what he wants from me. Because maybe maybe it's the dark matter. Maybe I've already traded it. But who knows? We're going to get Poli Polo Caliente. Nice. Uh, not really, to be honest. It's kind of kind of lame. I mean, I haven't even had a proper look at it. Uh, yeah, it's, just, it's okay, I guess. We got 10 more crates. The luck's not been that great so far, but I feel like with 10 crates left, there's got to be something in it. Otherwise, I'll be very disappointed. But even if it doesn't turn out well, I only traded the Dark Matter for it. There we go. Dominus GT. That can get you some good crates. That can get you at least five nowadays. So that, that's good. I feel like I've made my money's worth because a Dominus GT usually would go for more than a Dark Matter, I would say. But then again, someone gave me 12 crates for the Dark Matter, so we don't know. And I got the two other crates, by the way, for something else. But yeah, we got Shibuya for the breakout. Okay, I used to rep that uh, decal when I used the breakout. It's, it's pretty decent, pretty decent. Uh, let's keep going. We got eight more crates. Let's have a quick look again. Um, I'd, I wouldn't mind some Photon Wheels or some Looper. Any, any of the bottom three, any of the bottom six, to be honest, uh, would be fine. You know... It, it is what it is. It's fine. Let's keep going. Oh, man. If I keep getting crates from trades like this, I'm going to run out of money fast buying these keys. But I'm kind of addicted. It's like a gambling issue. Another combo. I've got, like, three now, I think. Um, I've got two other certified ones and this one. So, And that's certified as well. Let's have a quick look at this. Uh, we've got the Tactician, the Paragon, and the Show-Off. Can we trade any of these in? Okay, yeah. We've got some trades going down. Uh, in a minute, I need to go back to the inventory actually. And um, seven more crates. Come on, we're halfway through, and we've we've not got a lot to scream about. We got an import though. We did get the Dominus GT. I just haven't seen any Mystery Universal decal like anywhere near the spinner. So the Shibuya again. See, like I didn't see a, a Universal decal on that entire spin. Maybe I'm just being blind or or something. But you know, it would be great if we could get just something a little bit better. You know, come on. All right, let's see what we can get. The heat wave. If I got the heat wave, I think I'd freak out more than when I got the breakout type S because I've had that twice now, but I've never come close to getting the heat wave. 
Takumi RXT, that's all right. Import bodies are fine. They they go for a bit on the uh, on the old market. So that is that's that's not too bad. You've got to be happy with that. It's not certified, just normal. Five more crates. The old Kazelix five crate opening coming at you live from Pika Pixel's bedroom. <laughs> okay, let's see. Here we go. I'm also really intrigued as to what Adam wants from me. Oh, we just passed a load of good ones, so it's gonna be a it's gonna be a terrible one. One good thing about all the crates being the same is that they have to be in the same series due to trade in the decals. So the fact that it's all crate one and not like half and half means that we're probably gonna get a couple of trade ins actually. Of rare ones at least, and then maybe a couple very rare ones, but we haven't had many very rare items in this crate opening. Okay, we've passed some good stuff. <gasps> Come on! Yes! Yes! The universal decal! Are you serious? You're joking. You're joking. You are... You're joking me. I traded the slipstream away about five minutes ago. The crate luck, though. The crate luck. And a certified slipstream. We'll have a look at that at the end of this. Uh, but that means I got the slipstream for the dark matter, essentially. And all this other stuff for free. So that's fine. Um, can I be greedy and ask for another one? All right. A snake skin. Very rare. We're, we're... I just spat on the mic. We are picking it up towards the end of this crate opening. I can't... I was so happy when I saw Universal Decal. And then slipstream came up. I don't even know the other ones that uh, you can get. You can get Labyrinth. Um, Parallax, that, is that one, or is that a certification? I'm not sure. Heat Wave, um, oh, there's so many, and I got Slipstream twice. What are the odds of that, getting the same black market item twice? But then, to be fair, it means I've got it again, and I can put it on my car, which is great, because I literally traded it right before this video. Polo Caliente, ah, not feeling that. I'm not feeling that. I think we've got one more crate after this. Then we can do some trade-ins and see what we get. All right, there's the red decal. This is the final crate. Here we go. The final crate of the day. What's it going to be? Let's see. Come on. Be a buddy. Be a buddy. Come on. Of course, it's not going to be a good finish. Yeah, to be fair, you can't complain. I got the Takumi RXT, the Dominus GT, and the Universal decal. You cannot complain with that. So now let's trade some stuff in. Okay, we can trade all of those in because I don't use any of them. So we just got enough fair rares to get in. I've got everything in Champion Series 1 apart from the photon wheels. Literally everything. <laughs> Not anymore because I'm trading it in for an import. Okay, certified Trinity. That's okay. What was the Trinity? The certification for that. Uh, Playmaker. Okay, and we got Goalkeeper for the... For the black market. All right. Uh, what else we got? Takumi. Let's trade in these. We got one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so we can keep one out of these 11. Oh, my voice. <coughs> right. Uh, what should we keep out of all of these? Uh, probably not the Vice. I won't use the Takumi. So it'll probably probably want to keep the Shibuya. I think that that's probably good. Uh, so let's trade all... Wait, did I... Yeah, yeah. We'll trade these in. What's it going to be? It's going to be, oh, Shakram, certified wheels. All right, now let's go again and keep the Shibuya, because that's going to be the one we're going to use, if we're going to use any. Trade these in, and we get the Takumi Anubis. Right, so we can't trade these in. That's an epic save, a Guardian Shakram wheels, and I think that is it, unless we can trade in some imports. <gasps> oh, now. See, part of me for the video wants to trade in these five, and get either Photon Wheels, which I don't have and never have had, or Looper Wheels and trade them. But to be honest, I think whether it's Photon or Looper, you could get more trading these five separately than trading just a pair of those wheels. See, part of me wants to do it for the video, but I think I'm gonna... I'm not going to, because I've already got the Looper Wheels and, and yeah. I think that... I think that's it. I think that's going to be it for this video, but we can, what we can do is put our brand new goalkeeper black market animated decal back on the car, and now we're looking snazzy once again. We got the universal decal again. I can't believe it. I've had the mystery universal decal twice and the breakout type S twice, both of which my mate Max has never had. <laughs> He's not opened anywhere near as, crate, as many crates as me, I don't think. He's probably opened about 20, 25, 30. I reckon I've probably opened f closer to 50. Um, so, you know, I'm, I'm up on him on that. But this was a pretty successful video. If you did enjoy it, and if you are interested in with trading with me, then add me on PS4, uh, Artificial MDB, as you can see in the corner there. And we can have a chat about trading. But do it quickly, because there's a lot of people that want my stuff. 
So uh, that does it for me. If you did enjoy this video, then be sure to leave a like on it. Subscribe today if you want to see more Rocket League videos. That's pretty much all I'm posting at the moment. And I'll see you in the next video very soon.